So good morning, my name is Mary. I'm with uh, South Lake YMCA and this is Team Boot Camp. We'll get warmed up here. Uh, make sure you have some kind of weight, whether it's water bottles, soup cans, a chair for balance if you need it. And um, a little towel we might use later at the end of the stretch. But we'll get warmed up here. We're going to take our legs and march them. Looks like it's just you and me, Bob. <laughs> take our shoulders and roll them back. And roll your arms forward. We're going to bring our knees up and push down. We're going to go to each knee. The so knee, knee, switch, knee, 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 knee. Two more each leg. There's one and two. We're going to kick our rear, kick behind, and pull the rope back. Squeeze our shoulder blades together. And step touch to your right. Bring our elbows up with a pec press in and out. Someday we'll have music again, right? Take your arms, come up and down over your head. And pull them down behind the back. Big circles forward like you're swimming in the pool. And big circles back. Back. 
15 more seconds. Five more seconds. Last one. Nice job. Take those legs out. Next, we're going to drop our weight. We're going to do hammer curls. So you're going to hold your weights like you have hammers in your hand. We're going to bring them up and all the way down. Hammer curl. 45 seconds. Ready? Here we go. Think about contracting that muscle. Grab her in. Breathing. Knees are soft. Plus, think about. I think someone's here, so keep going. Let me get down in here. Five more seconds. And stop. Good job. Okay. Next, we're going to do side crunches. So we're going to hold our weights at our side. We're just going to go to the right side, to your right side. So we'll crunch to the right for 45 seconds. Here we go. Go down as far as you can. Those obliques, your tummy's in nice and tight. The other arm can come up if you like. Keep your knees soft. If you're breathing. Five more seconds. And stop. That was a long five seconds. <laughs> All right. Take it out. Next, we're going to do shoulder presses. So we're going to hold the weights at our shoulders. We're going to push them up to the ceiling. So we'll do that for 45 seconds. Here we go. Keeping our abs are nice and tight, so we're working those as well with our shoulders. The knees are still soft, don't walk them out. It's all the way up to the ceiling. Bring all the way down to your shoulders. Ten more seconds. Almost there. One more. And stop. Nice stop. Roll those shoulders. Place your weights down. We're going to do a set of modified jumping jacks for 30 seconds. And then we'll do those four exercises again. Okay? You ready? Here we go. 30 seconds, modified jumping jack. Back, 
Watch your knees. Don't go past your toes. Two, three. Ten more seconds. Do one more squat. There we go. Good job. Shake out those legs. We're going to grab our weights, go back to our hammer curl. This time we're going to alternate. You have your right and your left. Squeeze those biceps. Do the down, just put in. One second. And stop. Good. Okay. Next to our side crunches. This time we're going to go to your left. Ready? Here we go. We're going to do 45 on this one since we need to have balance. Up. Down as far as you can. Breathe. Pass it in. Ten more seconds. And stop. Good. Pull those shoulders. Pull those hips. All right. Next are our shoulder presses. For 30 seconds. Here we go. Down to our shoulders, all the way up to the ceiling. Shoulders are protecting. Ten more seconds. And stop. Good job. All right, before we do our set our weights down, before we do our uh, next set, we're going to do another set of modified jumping jacks for 30 seconds. Ready? Here we go. Ten more seconds. And stop. Good job. All right. Up front a little bit. Grab a drink. And we'll get going on our next set. Ten so the next. We're going to do um, standing curls. You can hold on to your chair if you like. We're just going to curl our leg up. We're going to work your hamstring and your glutes for this. Okay? So we'll do um, one leg first, 45 seconds, and then the second round, we'll do the other leg. Ready? Here we go. Curl that leg. Think about contracting that muscle. Squeeze it. Abs are in tight. Breathing. Try to use the least amount of fingers on your chair. You can also work it out a little bit. Please. Good. 
15 more seconds. Five more. And stop. Good job. Stick that leg out. Okay. We're going to grab one of our weights. We're going to try to set kick back so your elbow's going to be up towards the ceiling. You're going to lock the shoulder in place. The only thing moving is going to be your elbow. Okay, we're going to kick it back. So we'll do that for 45 seconds. Ready? Here we go. You can hold on to your chair if you like. Lean over. Remember your shoulders locked. Your elbow parallel to the ceiling. The only thing moving is that elbow. Squeezing that tricep muscle chest. Abdomen. Keep breathing. Fifteen more seconds. One more time. Woo, relax. Roll that shoulder. Pick up that arm. Good job. Okay, we're going to use two weights. We're going to do a core rotation. We're going to keep our hips straight on. Knees are soft. We'll push to one side, come back to the center, and twist together. Okay? 45 seconds. Here we go. Push to one side, back to the center, and to the other. Keep those hips straight on, knees are soft. All same side. Working on core muscles. Almost there, you're doing great. Five more seconds. And stop. Good. Take it out, roll the hips around. All right. Last in this group is the pec press. So our elbows are going to be, even with our shoulder going to squeeze our elbows together. Okay? 45 seconds. Here we go. Squeeze. Abs are in tight, bring those elbows together, take them all the way back out wide. Try to keep them up, shoulder high. Breathe, squeeze. Breathe, squeeze. 15 more seconds. One more squeeze, and good job. Roll those shoulders, nice job. Okay, put your weights down, we're gonna do a set of modified jumping jacks, and then we'll do those four exercises again, okay? So 30 second jumping jack, ready? Here we go. Five more seconds. And stop. Good job. All right. Take those legs out, walk around, grab a drink. Okay, we're going to do our other leg. A leg curl. We'll do it for 
we're going to start out and do that slow march. Have your chair handy in case you need to grab it. There is one leg up. Bring it down the other, other leg. Use your hands to balance. Focus on the floor if you need to. Let's get our balance. As high as you can, and hold it there. Slow march. Do one more each leg. Here's one. And the last one. Good job. Okay. Next, you want to have your chair handy if you need it. We're going to tap to the front, tap to the side, tap behind. And then across. Okay? All the same way. So as in, here we go. We're going to do this. We'll do it um, five times. Okay? So tap to the front, tap behind, tap to the side, and across. Front, behind, side, across. Front, behind, Side, drop. Front, behind, side, and drop. Front, behind, side, and across. This is the last one. Front, behind, side, and drop. Good job. Shake up that base leg. We're going to switch legs. So if you need to switch your, your uh, chair, do that. So here we go. This is your other leg now. Front, behind, side, and front. Front, behind, side, front. Front, behind, side, front. Front, behind, side, and front. Last one. Front. Behind, side, and across. Good job. Get your legs out. And let's do um, our heel toe. So you can just put a heel in front of your other foot's toes and stand there. Use your arms for balance. Grab your chair if you need to with your fingertips. If that seems okay for you, try to walk the line. Remember, it's easier to focus on something at the floor and not look at the screen and see if it's bobble or not yet. <laughs> so see if you can walk up three or four steps, feel the toe nice and slow, working on your balance. And if that went okay, let's see if we can go backwards. Feel the toe back, nice and slow. All right, good job. Okay, so for our flexibility, we're going to do some finger flexibility. So we're going to start out with a fist, make a tight fist, and then open your fingers nice and wide. Fist, wide. Wide, one more of these, this, and wide. Okay, next we're going to take our fingers and you're going to make a claw and then we're going to touch our fingers down to the palm of our hand. Okay? So claw, palm, claw, palm, claw, palm, claw, palm, claw, palm, one more, claw, and palm. Good. Are those fingers? Okay. We're going to do touch our thumb to each one of our fingers. Okay. And when we open them up, they're going to be wide, and then you're going to go back to the other finger. Okay. So we'll do pointer, middle, ring, pinky. Pointer, 
middle ring pinker middle ring pinky pinky ring middle pointer pinky ring middle pointer pointer middle ring pinky pointer middle ring pinky good job threw it in there to mess you up so shake out those fingers rotate your wrist and reverse it all right grab your towel <clears throat> easy hot one we're going to run our shoulder flexibility so what you want to do is bring one arm up and reach your fingertips together. If you can't reach them, use your towel and take the hand that's behind and walk your way up as far as you can. And try to touch your fingers, that's your goal. And then we're going to hold it here. We're going to count to 12 today. So ready? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Good job. Release it. Hold those shoulders. Get them out. Okay, other arm. You need your towel. Use your towel. One side makes it easier than the other. Now reach your fingers up. Walk them towards the other. Go up as far as you can. And then we're going to hold it there and count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Good job. Roll those shoulders. Anybody getting it a little easier, a little further? What's something you could do after you're doing dishes? Stretch out. Bring those arms again. We're going to pull down, step touch to our right, nice and slow. Take one shoulder over the back and the other. And roll forward. That's an awesome one, huh? <laughs> All right, grab your towel again. Hold it so it's hot. So it's about shoulder width apart. So you're going to reach all the way up. And come up on your toes. Stretch. Nice big stretch. And come down. And then put your feet about hip width apart. Knees stop. Bend all the way down. Feel a nice stretch in your glutes and your hamstrings. Come all the way up. Go up on those tippy toes. Pull on that towel and come down. Go all the way down again, knee stop. Stretch up those hamstrings and glutes. And while we're here, we're going to take a big circle up one direction and all the way around. Again, around, pulling on your towel. One more time on this side. And then hang down at the bottom. Let's go the opposite direction. One more. And rest. All right. You can grab your ankle or your toes or just hold your leg up there. We're going to stretch out our quadriceps. You can rotate your foot by holding it up there. All right, release it, shake out that leg, grab the other one. Elbows close your ankle or just hold it up there. If you want to stretch, pause that. Rotate your ankle around while you're up there. And release it. Take one leg out, point your toe up to the ceiling. We're going to slowly hinge over. If you need your chair, use your chair. Reach down as far as you can, whether that's your stick or your ankles, your shoestrings, your toes. 
Stretching out that hamstring. And slowly come up. Stretch leg, bring the other leg up, point the toe up. Hinge over, reaching as far as you can. Nice press in that hamstring. And slowly come up. Nice big breath in, both arms up. And let it out. One more big breath in. And let it out. Good job. Thanks for coming to class today. If you want to unmute, you can chit chat. We have a couple minutes. Good job.